The GMA cover story and Bendy Irwin pulling back the curtain on her battle with endometriosis and sharing her message for women everywhere. Ariel Reshef is here with the story. Good morning, Ariel. Good morning, Michael. So many women suffer from endometriosis in silence, and Bindi was no different. She says for years she lived with excruciating pain until finally she underwent a major surgery and got the diagnosis and life-changing relief. This morning, conservationist Bindi Irwin is speaking out about her debilitating battle with endometriosis. The pain, fatigue, nausea that I was feeling, it was tackling my whole life. The 24-year-old daughter of the late environmentalist and crocodile hunter Steve Irwin appearing by video with her mom and brother at the Endometriosis Foundation of America's Blossom Ball earlier this week. Just two weeks ago underwent enormous surgery. They found 37 lesions and now for the first time in over 10 years, I feel like I have a second chance at life. Her surgeon telling us endometriosis is often overlooked, which can sometimes lead to a 10 year delay in proper diagnosis. It doesn't show up in any imaging and there's no blood test. Only by laparoscopy we can really tell by looking inside directly with a camera. Uh, we can diagnose endometriosis. Bindi first revealing her decade-long search for answers in an Instagram post earlier this month, writing, validation for years of pain is indescribable. The mom to nearly two-year-old daughter Grace adding, please be gentle and pause before asking me or any woman when we'll be having more children. After all that my body has gone through, I feel tremendously grateful that we have our gorgeous daughter. Research shows 11% of women ages 15 to 44 suffer from endometriosis in the U.S., a condition where cells normally found in the lining of the uterus are found outside the uterus, which can cause severe cramps, pelvic pain, painful intimacy, scar tissue and infertility. When it comes to women's symptoms and painful period, they don't associate with the disease. So the woman has to really pursue and find a doctor that they, they, will, they will be taken seriously. Now I have this amazing opportunity to focus my energy and life on our conservation work around the world. Our family, my daughter, I feel so incredibly excited for this second chance at life pain free. And Bindi says she wants to break the stigma about this disease, encouraging women to be their own health advocates, as you heard there, if they are in pain and not to ignore the signs. We have more about endometriosis and Bindi's story on GoodMorningAmerica.com. So important that she's speaking. Absolutely. Out, Hopefully she can help a lot of people, Ariel. Thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.